Hi guys, David and Betty here from MKR. And today we're here at the Tram Sheds in Howard Park in Sydney's Forest Lodge. And we're going to be doing our first cooking class today guys and it's 360, so make sure you guys come and watch us. I'm super excited, let's go Betty. Let's go. Okay guys, we're back in the kitchen. And now we're going to make our chicken satay that you might have seen from the sauce challenge. You guys can follow us around, it is a three it is a 360 kitchen, so... There's nowhere to hide today. There is nowhere to hide. So let's get cooking, Betty. Let's get cooking. Let's get to our stations. What are you going to start on first, Betty? So I'm going to start off with the chicken first, David. We are using chicken thighs today. Great. Because it's nice and juicy. And, plus I like thighs. I like using thighs. <laughs> I know my mum would be like, yes, let's use chicken breast, but we're using thighs today, mum. So. Yeah. You know, our, with this recipe, you can actually use different types of protein. You can use pork, you can use beef whatever you really like, but um, yeah, today we're using thighs, it's nice and juicy, and um, once we marinate it, which I'm gonna make right now for you, Betty. Yeah, what's in the marinade, David? Uh, it's my mum's recipe, this one. It's actually coconut milk, some turmeric and some garlic. And once you slice up the chicken, I'm gonna uh, marinate in here for about maybe half an hour. Yeah. Not much time today. Half an hour's pretty but good. You can definitely make this the night before for any guests coming over, yeah? Yep. With the marinade, we're going to add some coconut and turmeric and it's going to add a nice colour and flavour and moisten the chicken. So once David is marinating the chicken, guys, I'm going to get started on our curry paste. This awesome. is actually Mum's perfect mistake that she did, she's done for me when we were cooking at home. She mistakenly grabbed the chicken, the curry paste to add to the satay paste. So it, was, it turned out beautiful and I love it and I want to share this with you guys. I remember doing this today with the first time and you loved it, right David? Oh, it just adds that little bit of extra spicy kick that I love. If you've got the time, marinate this overnight. While you're doing that, I'm going to jump into the uh, salad dressing for our cucumber salad. So if you guys follow me, I'm going to start blending off the curry paste. Great, so with my sauce for the, the dressing for the salad, it's really simple. It's just some chilli sauce, sweet chilli sauce, some apple cider vinegar, some sugar, and then we're going to mix it up with some water. Yep. The cucumber salad is going to be nice and fresh and give a nice bite to our dish. Oh, that's Asia right there. Nice. Yeah. We're ready to fry this off, guys, so let's, let's start go. on our satay. Okay, guys, let's start cooking. We're let's going to start this. by frying off the curry paste first and then adding the peanut sauce. Yeah, so the peanut sauce is just peanut butter. And it's a major ingredient in this dish, right, Betty? Yes, it is. And it's so easy to make. So it's just unsalted peanuts with some peanut oil, and you blitz it up into a fine paste. And we like it crunchy, so we didn't blitz it up that much, that much, right, Betty? No, I like my peanut butter quite crunchy, yeah. guys. And it adds a little bit of texture to the dish as well. That's the peanut butter, Betty. Thank you. And while you're doing that, I'm gonna thread the chicken and uh, to the skewers and ready to fry it. Yeah. Yep. We've got some fresh kalanga, guys. It's like supercharged ginger. <laughs> we need to fry off the curry paste first, make sure that's really nice and fragrant. So a couple of minutes before we add in everything else, okay? And this chicken is beautiful, Betty. The turmeric and the coconut milk soak into the chicken. It's nice and tender. Yep. And it's going to give a beautiful colour when we, uh, we uh, fry it off. We can't it off. wait to dig in. So once the paste is nice and fragrant, guys, we can then add in our peanut butter. And make sure you combine really well. Yum. Chicken's done, Betty. I'm just going to wash my hands. Yeah. So, guys, I'm going to get into a nice, fresh salad with the cucumbers, so come with me. We always love a side. We always love a side salad, don't we, David? Yeah, you know what? It's it's a, such a creamy dish. You want something nice and fresh to break it up. So, cucumber salad, a Thai cucumber salad is going to be a beautiful complement to our dish. The cucumber salad is going to be nice and fresh and complement our creamy satay sauce. Because uh, with our cucumber salad, we're going to actually uh, core the cucumber, get all these seeds out because this is where all the water lies in the cucumber and we leave it in there, it's going to get really soggy and wet. So it's quite simple, you just get a spoon and you just dig it out. I'm just popping in the chicken in now guys. We're going to make sure that they're nice and golden before we take them out. So with the sauce guys, once it's reduced we can turn off the heat and then we can season. Make sure you guys balance it well. There's only two things that we're actually adding into the sauce, guys. We're, only, we're using fish sauce and also some brown sugar. Now we're grilling up the chicken and give it a nice char to give that authentic flavour. So I'm going to assemble the cucumber salad now. It's really easy. You just put the cucumber in a bowl. Some echelots and some red onion I've uh, chopped earlier. 
Just add a little fresh bite in there. And to that, I'm gonna add some cori uh, coriander. This is my favorite herb. And with the coriander, I'm gonna use the whole coriander, including the stem, because that's where all the flavor lies, and you don't wanna throw that out. Guys, with the ingredients, it's really important if you do try to source for fresh ingredients, but if you can't, bottle the ones that you see black, it's just fine. Oh, guys, we're gonna add one more thing. We can actually add some ground chili into our sauce as well, because, you know, chili's good for the soul. You love chili, don't you? I love <laughs> my chili. This is a family friendly recipe. If you don't like it too spicy, just don't put as much chili in it. How's it going? Oh, yeah. yeah. So it's elevating the chicken just from just being grilled chicken to actually having a bit of flavour and in the marinade, you might think. Yep. And with the marinade, you can do it a month earlier. You're going to have time. Uh, do it the night before. You can just leave it in there as long as you want. The longer you leave it, the more flavour it's going to infuse into that chicken and it's going to make it more moist. Yep. See the little yellow colour, guys, with the turmeric? Adds a beautiful flavour to the chicken. So, guys, the sauce done. We're about to plate up. How are you going today, David? I uh, need another minute, Betty. Need another minute. Well, I'll get everything ready over there on the, so on the Set that up and table. I'll be able to pull the chicken up in a sec. Yep. Yeah, that smells amazing. Well, I'm going to grab the salad over on that side. Yes, please. And then I'll get the setup ready yep, for us I'll... putting everything together. So while Betty's uh, uh, splicing up some extra condiments, I'm going to add some peanuts to our salad. And give it a bit more crunch. I'm going to put some rice into our ramekin. I've got some coriander here, guys, and also some fresh chili um, yep. salad. David, please. Yep. yep. And we've got our chicken skewers here, guys. Just pop that right next to the rice. Three, three is always a good number. Yeah. It's always when you're plating up. It's always good to do in odd numbers. Yeah. Just makes it look prettier on the plate. The salad, nice and fresh and rice. Awesome. And of course, some of our beautiful sauce right on the top of that chicken. Don't be stingy on the sauce, Betty. No, I'm not going to be stingy. <laughs> sauce is a key to a dish. It makes the dish, so... Yeah. Lather that on. Beautiful. Beautiful. Finish that off. We're going to add some extra... Peanuts. Crushed peanuts on top. Little peanut bay, Betty. <laughs> peanut bay. Some coriander and also some fresh chili, guys. Some beautiful colour. Beautiful colour. And you're done. There you have it. Our chicken satay dish. Please enjoy.